Hey guys, it's Matthew from Jam Bricks, and today we're going to be reviewing the Lego Star Wars TIE Fighter Pilot Helmet. As you can see here, it is recommended for ages 18 plus, set number 75274, and 724 pieces. Again, with the box art for the helmet sets, it has the really cool black background, which I love, along with like red kind of touches along here that surrounds pretty much most of the helmet that to me is just amazing for like a box this ain't even like a UCS set or anything it just really stands out on most other boxes uh, on the side here it shows the helmet again and it says helmet collection there up top and we look down here it says Empire Strikes Back 40 years or as it says here for 40th the Empire Strikes Back down here it just says Lego Star Wars. Alright, let's check out the back. Again, Lego and Star Wars there. And we just have the TIE Fighter Pilot helmet again at a different angle. As you can see the sides here. And curving. I also like how it has the uh, parts here with the Empire symbol. And down here it shows the TIE Fighter Pilot. That's him. Himself. That's what he looks like. And right over here, it says how tall the helmet is, which is seven inches tall, which actually I think is pretty tall. And over here, we got the TIE Fighter Pilot helmet sideways, so you can kind of see like the side of it. And as you can see here, we got this side. It says the helmet in different language. I not sure what it is because I do not know any other languages than English so yeah get the point and that's the box I'll go ahead and open this baby up and I'll be back with the magazine and back Thank you everybody who subscribed to the channel we really appreciate it. and also I just want to know if you guys like the video so please comment down below like Hey, I like the video, or if you have something we could improve on, that would be great, guys. We always want to know feedback from you guys. Now, let's get to the unboxing. Yeah, I'm just open up this box a sec. Here we go. And there's not really any special designs. Just a little scan code right there. Got all the bags in there. There we go. On the other sets, there was five bags. Four, second. Oh, there's actually six on this one, guys. There, there's six bags for this here. And we got the magazine along with a long whole thing here. I think there will be two of those for both of the pour out somewhere over here. Um, uh, I don't know. I don't know. Let's just go into the magazine review. See here. Show some information about the TIE Fighter Pilot. And we have the TIE Fighter Pilot again. Right here at a different angle as you can see. And then down here, we got it again. And it just kind of shows some different languages. Here it just shows brick remover. How much you build in the bag? One, two, three, four, five, and six. So we do need two of these. I'll try to find that in a sec. But let's just continue with this. See, just has build. Skip the back of the magazine. Oh, there's the other one. It was inside the magazine. Okay. So we found the other one. Alright. That's good. Really open that was not a missing piece. And back here it just shows how many pieces if you wanted to like collect them off of Bricklink or something. Yeah. And the final product right here. I'll build this thing up and I'll be back to review the final set. So I just finished building the model and it looks amazing guys. Just how it looked on the box is what it looks like here. It didn't take that long to build which is great. 
And yeah, there's just a bunch of details to go through with you guys. Well, I don't like how there's no figures, but yeah. It's more of a display model anyway. Over here at the breathing tubes right here on the side, on both sides. Down here we got the plaque that says Lego Star Wars TIE Fighter Pilot Helmet. And it is not a sticker, so you don't have to worry about placing a sticker, which is many people and me are happy about. And we got like a stand here to place the helmet on. It holds in the tubes. And across the top, there is a big line that goes all the way down to here. Along with some Empire symbols on both sides of his helmet. And here on the sides, we got like, I don't know what these are. I think there's some sort of communication thing to speak back with. I'm not sure. Maybe this part is the communication. I am not sure. But yeah, this thing is amazing again. Um, let's see. Things I didn't really like about the set, again, there was no figures. Um, it was a little small for the piece count, because you see some other sets for like 723 pieces that are a little bit bigger than the set, but again, it's not that bad. It's actually a pretty good set to me. Uh, it's definitely the best out of the three helmets to me. Some other people probably don't think so, but yeah, in my opinion, I think that. Yeah, and I really love the black color on it. It just sparkles, bro. It's so cool. Right here, there's two little pieces that kind of make like a line. I am not sure what that's for, but it looks cool. I don't know. Um, yeah. This one did probably take a little bit longer than the other models to build because there was like 18 mini discs right here that you had to put onto like a... Uh, long cord that you attach into both sides yeah but it was not much longer to me um yeah this again is a great set I would definitely recommend buying it yeah I'll see you guys later like always guys please like and subscribe to the channel that'd be great it would definitely help us and you join a great Lego channel I'll see you guys later.